Yo, hello there guys and welcome back for a little bit more of Let's Play God of War with Mikey Mega Mega live on twitch.tv forward slash Mikey Mega Mega. We, in the last episodes of Kratos and his son, have uh, actually made the water level drop a little bit on the lake because we revealed the snake, careful family stream, and uh, now there's much more to access. It wants us to go here, so of course in the way of searching we're going to go everywhere else for a little bit and see what we can find. I hope you are all doing very, very well. Well, come on in. How are you guys doing in Twitch? Hey, dock here. Map updated. New dock found. I'm very pleased. Hidden area discovered. The lookout tower. New area on the map. Beautiful. Richly animated. Pleased to be here. And we've got some of this business. Oh! Be ready! Nice. As long as the kid supports me with the bow, he can keep these assholes distracted even if they're a bit long range. Vestiary added. It's some kind of drawing. Maybe a map? Oh! Maybe a treasure map! Hunter's Kingdom. I cannot read these words. Motskonir, ruler of man and beast. I came to his kingdom to learn if he had obtained the ingredients to forge the armor of legend. All I found was death and sorrow. I leave this offering in memory of those who have suffered in a dwarf king's quest for glory. <sighs> Rare enchantment, alloys, stuff, and 6,000 schmeckles. So, I have to find that location, right? Is it then on the map? Hmm. Okay, so, we've got some ding-dongs, but they're all protected by spikes. Magic bucket. Hack silver, thank you. What's a bestiary? It's like Tinder for farm workers. Of all the things you could have said, I think that was one of the safest answers. It's a place you can go if you're into some weird shit, but you have to put on incognito mode. See it? Cam, 20,000. How you doing, man? Hope you're having a lovely day. <sighs> Yeah, we stream. Us. Us stream. The ability to stream does not make you intelligent. Misa stream. Yeah, no, dude, we're just chilling out. Yeah, relaxing on a Sunday. Uh, I, dude, I stream artwork and uh, video games. And uh, on a nice Sunday relax, we just vibe. I see. So that's what locks your boys open. So we've got to go as quickly as possible. Got it. Oh. One. Oh, sorry. Uh, I haven't even located the third one. Quick, quick, quick. Nice. Oh. Oh, it... Didn't do the first one in time. No worries, we got this. Danny Kudo, everyone having a good time. Danny Kudo, actually a great time. Um, I've just ordered some delicious Indian food. Uh, just got a cheeky donut that's actually paid for half of it. Loving this game because it turns out it's a brilliant game. So we're vibing our way. Did I just knock that kid over? Another legendary I done apple. I gone done the apple. Big brain nonetheless. Yeah, thank you very much, man. Hope you guys are doing bloody well. You just saw treasure and yeeted him off the screen. <laughs> Look, it's his fault. These kids get in your way if you're not careful. So I want to just get the loot that that guy's got. And I, f I think that's the only other thing. Wasn't I going to make the kid climb up there or something? One sec. Let me just get a little bit more of this uh, goodly juice. <laughs> Oh, that didn't do it at all. Oh, that stopped moving. 
Have I screwed up the animation? Oh! Oh, it had worked. I thought it hadn't worked at all. Abandoned ship, new artifact town. So this is one of the ship heads. Exploring the Lake of Nine, we found this beautiful figurehead. It may be all that's left of a ship that once went on great adventures. I wonder if there are more among the wrecks and beaches. I wonder if there's exactly four, five, six, seven, eight more. Maybe Brock will give us some hacks over for them. Okay, so this is good. Can I get my sweet self up here? Right. I'm assuming, guys, I can't destroy this yet. But this is like the equivalent of something that I can bust open if I've got like whatever this game's version of the Nemean lines. Lines of Cestus were? My gear's a magpie, confirmed. I like the shiny. I'm not sensitive, I'm American. Oh, even worse. I'm playing on a PS4. And we've got a PS5, but this game doesn't need a PS5, if you know what I mean. So um, after we play this, we're going to be playing Ghost of Tsushima. But we're going to play the original Ghost of Tsushima in Kurosawa mode. And we're only going to do the main plot. And then later, we're going to play the updated multicolored PS5 version with the bonus island. Because I've got it on a PS4 and I still haven't unwrapped it. And I'm bloody well going to use it. <laughs> Yo, how do I get the boy up there? Maybe that's going to be for later. There's something up there. Hmm. Oh. Oh, yeah. A little bit of hack silver. So does anybody know? Am I, am I going to worry about getting the kid to go up here now? Or is that something that happens later when I'm able to kind of cut myself a path that goes further up there? It's a bit more further up there, huh? All right, let's go back in the boot. Adventure? Oh, wait. Huzzah! Okay, so if anybody's vibing along and watching this on YouTube, hi, thank you very much. You're always welcome to come join us live on Twitch, blah, blah, blah. But um, we played not where I've just been, but I had had a bit of a warm up earlier. Where I've checked out this kind of island, or at least the front side. <gasps> oh, wait, I haven't... No, not this. This is brand new. But basically, I'm aware that there's some very, very difficult enemies. The witch's cave? Is this going back the way we came from? We did come from a witch, but now that the water level's changed, it might be... It might have different cool stuff. We might be in grave danger. Yeah, I think this is heading back to the turtle house. But there was some other stuff to investigate, but but it was too flooded. If I remember correctly, it's for later. Yo, thank you very much. I think we actually might be onto something just by going all the way back here. It's so long and twisty. I'm assuming this is for loading reasons. You want to dock here? Uh, we might as well have a look, yeah. So basically, we're doubling back where we were in the last episode, but it's worth a shifty little look around. Huh? The water dropped. And the serpent rose. Right. I knew that. What on earth is this? <laughs> Something for later. Oh, did the shifting water mean that... Oh, because normally I'd be boating up there. Right, it's literally just kind of saying I can't go back this way until I can do something about that red jism prism. No worries. Let's go back. I've got to return. Come on, Kratos. Oh, yo, did I ever put us That's in the right game? Statue. 
Who built it, you think? I do not know. I did, thankfully. Alright, back where we were. Lake of Nine. So we shifted back in this lake. Let's smash this up. We shifted back in this lake from just going around there. So let's put our sweet selves just up here. Oh, good. I was hoping we might explore a little. When we wish to continue our journey, we know to return here. Mm. Welcome to exploring time. Got some more dead warriors. Can we jump down in here? No business here. Can we go around the other side? I feel like we could get up here, but it might be the next one. Yeah, so this one's already raised. I've got no crank handle access there. So we're going to check out the next one along. I see some loot up there. Loot, yes. Crank, no. Oh, crank, no. Right. What happened here? Shipwreck. Well, yeah. I wonder why it crashed. Another spot on the map. Another dock. Tried Ghost of Tsushima. Oh, gags, we were literally just talking about that, dude. Um, I have it on the PS4. Still haven't opened it, the original. And now they've announced that they're re-releasing it. Improved graphics for the PS5 with bonus content. So what we're going to do is, after we play this God of War, we're going to play Ghost of Tsushima in black and white Akira Kurosawa mode. We're not going to linger in the game, because basically I'm a sucker for old school black and white beautiful Japanese cinema. Um, my, one of the few things my mum really got me into, like... My mum once woke me up at like two o'clock in the morning on a school night and she was like, Mikey, they're playing a, uh, they're playing the Seven Samurai on uh, Channel 4. You, you're going to want to watch this. And I was like, holy shit. She was right. One more for the collection. It's a very long film. Um, but so I really, instead of like, I really want my first experience of Ghost of Tsushima to be in that black and white mode. So we're going to focus on the main plot so we don't spend forever in there. And then later down the line, I can play the PS5 remake version and we'll do like the whole actually wandering around and doing all the side quests and shit. But um, if any of you were hanging around when we were watching the E3 trailers and stuff, I randomly was just like, I would love a black and white samurai game. And then I think I literally said, I'd love a game like Ghost of Tsushima, but it's in black and white. And you guys were literally just like, Mikey, that's a that's an actual function that you can do. And I was a happy chap. I don't know these rooms. If we find a cipher, I bet I could figure it out. Yo, so long story short, in some recent investigations, this is like an evil black portal to another dimension. It's like the evil inter-particle black shadow evil things that's in uh, Eclipse. No, the Expanse, the Expanse. Except it just brings out really tough enemies. So bear with a sec. I'll give you an example, but we might die. Hey! Eyes of Odin! Another kill! So, allow me to show you guys what the problem is. Swings means I can't parry them. <laughs> I just gotta just get knocked in the kidneys and die. So those are one hit kill mofos. They're a little bit juicy for me right now. But we could have just one more quick go. Just one quick go to make sure I can't I just one quick go to make sure I definitely can't do anything about them. And uh, then we will continue on. I won't make a slinger. Because that would be silly and irresponsible. But uh, 
I can't help tasting the rainbow. Do you know what I mean? Okay, we've already got that crow. Your mum is cool. She had she had the odd good bits. The odd she had her odd flaringly good moments. Whole game in black and white. I could never gag. So that's why we're just going to focus on cracking through. Like I might get bored of the gimmick quite quickly, but I would love to experience it that way first because I've never played it. Um, barely seen any footage of anyone else playing it. I just know it's massive. You can just put um, Game of Game of Thrones. Oh, Ghost of Tsushima in the PlayStation Five. Oh yeah, Michael. I think I heard this. They up. You can do. You still have to buy the extra DLC, but you can upgrade the game. Yo, good to know. So I'm gonna flash him. My only hope is that they're slow, so I'm just like, maybe. So guys, I'm kind of wasting your time because we are inevitably going to die. But I just, this is our last go. Our last bit of cheese. <gasps> there we go. There we go. I might genuinely have a go at that offline sometime. But uh, don't worry, guys. We're going to continue on and vibe. We don't have to fight those enemies. Uh, they're a little bit for later in the game, I suspect. Dude, why? The colours are the best part. Oh, dude, because I, I grew up with a load of classic black and white Japanese movies and Japanese cinema. Um, so it's just a way that I would really like to experience it. But that's, like I say, that's why I'm only going to do the main story. Like, literally just go through it. And I'm not going to spend any extra frivolous time in the game. Because then if I want to play it in the future, I'll play the updated multicolour bonus content bonus island thing. Okay, so we now know that maybe because of the desolation that's happening here, there's um, portals that allow even more Neverworld Draugrish demons all up and inside people's business. No good, that is. No good for no one. Yo, continuing our adventure round into a water town, what else can we find? Barrels for breaking and treats for baking. Mega Mega Clutch. Never mind. I know, I know. I would have loved to have absolutely nailed that for the next 20 minutes. But no cheese. 